said T would beat my ass. I wish, see, I wish I would have known half of this shit that this chick said. I wish I'd have known that. Like, <laughs> okay. That's when I was just like, fuck you, bitch. And then she got all riled up, huffing and puffing like she finna do something. And I said, why don't you hop across this table? I mean, they cut that part out. It's like, it's like they just want me to look like a bitch sometimes. <laughs> this ain't the, the alcohol talking. It's just, just me. Like, I'm starting to get frustrated, for real. Like, Anyways, but they, they cut out the part that I wanted to stay in there because this girl was, the reason why she was upset with me is because I went to go see Nicole mom or something and she made this comment talking about some, I lost all respect for you. And when I was in my confessional, I said, this motherfucker talk about I lost her respect, like her respect means something to me. I said, who the fuck are you to me? You a drug addict felon. That's what you are. I don't give a damn about your respect. I said, Tia can take her respect. I said, Tia can take her respect. And like The Rock used to say, she can take her respect, shine it up real nice, turn that son bitch sideways, and stick it straight up her candy ass. That's what she can do with her respect. That's how much I said. I wipe my ass with Tia's respect. I'm so mad they cut that. I'm... I, <laughs> I was like waiting for that part. I remember telling Derek, I said, wait till you see this, dog. And it's just, her respect don't mean a damn thing to me. Like, I, <sighs> I want to say something. I really want to say how I feel about both of them, but I can't. I can only talk about that one. Because <laughs> I got, oh. <laughs> Sorry, I ain't trying to get in my feelings, man. Uh, anyway, I said that Nicole get up crying, all you know what I'm saying. So, man, I'm trying to like, I said, all right, let me try to lighten this. Let me calm down, try to just lighten this situation out before I leave. Because I'm just a good, I'm just too, I'm nice, man. I'm nice. I can't help it. I just, I don't like confrontations. I try to ease out every situation I'm in. Even a situation like that one. So. So I'm just like. Alright. Let me try to be the bigger man. And apologize to this chick. Even though I can't fucking stand her. I'm still gonna apologize to her. Because I'm a man. I'm gonna do what a man should do. And she ain't accepted. <laughs> And that's what I wanted to snap again. That's why I got up and walked out. I said, man, fuck this shit. Like, why am I even here? What you call me here for if I could just go? Yeah, you could go, yo. You could go. What the fuck you call me here for? I, you know what I'm saying? Like, so I'm sorry for cussing so much, but that's just where my mind was <laughs> at that time. So, you know what I'm saying? That's what that was. So, and then Tia talking, sitting in her little interview, confessional, or whatever. Ain't nobody motherfucking scared of you, bro. <laughs> you want to be a bro. You don't scare nobody but Nicole. I hope you know that. If you watching this and you know where the fuck I'm at. Both of y'all do. Anyways. Now for a lighter mood. Did you see the rest of the show? Brittany, man, you saw Brittany, Brittany, you got to leave Ray alone, man. He just, he just trying to hang out with the guy. He got his collar shirt on. He done, he done made him some bacon and eggs. <laughs> he just trying to hang out, man. Brittany, you got to, and then her home girl, girl, we need to pull up. I said, oh, Lord, here they go. <laughs> know what I'm saying? You sound stupid. Stop being nice. I ain't finna. I ain't doing it tonight. Uh, they all tell you this is embarrassing. I, I ain't doing it. Anyways, um, yeah. Brittany, <laughs> we gonna have to talk. Ray just trying to be cool and you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Brittany ain't playing. 
And Lacey, I, I was like, come on, Lacey. I almost cried for Lacey. You know what I'm saying? And I was staying. <laughs> yeah. But uh, let me go ahead and chit chat with some people. Since I done went on my little rant. Ray seemed like a nice guy. Yeah, he cool. Yeah, he, Ray he need time with the boys for a few hours. That's all. You about to take the 45 minute drive? Go ahead and take it. Ain't nobody. <laughs> oh, LB. I didn't see you in there. I miss you. I was wondering what happened to you, Elvie. 